Oh my God! <laughs> so we're at the election. I expect insanity. I'm expecting pure insanity from this episode. I want it, I need it, and I feel like somehow Ishigami's gonna end up on that stage and I'm gonna scream. So, if you haven't already, like and subscribe, comment down below, turn on notifications, follow me on social media, and if you wanna watch fully unedited or uncensored versions of this, make sure you subscribe to the Patreon, but support in all formats is appreciated. Let's begin. By a landslide? Why does it have to be by a landslide? Yeah. Wait, does he like Miko? He just wants to see her suffer. Does he want to see? Wait, why does he look more like he looks older? Yeah, there's something between them. Okay, yeah, this is amazing. This is amazing. What do you, girl? What the fuck? You can't. Wait, why not? Oh. Are you Ishigami's mate? Okay. Like, I'm literally looking for, like, other, like, couples now. Everywhere. You, Saku. Yeah, you're not gonna beat them. It's fucking over, girl. Yeah. Ah, you, Saku. <laughs> you can say all of that about people, but the thing is, no one actually knows who she is in the wider student body. So it's kind of just like, an action speaks so much louder than words. And they are, Miyuki has been president. So period, it's over, you lose, it's done. She sounds like they're not paying attention because she sounds like a robot, there's no passion behind it. She did, she did, because she's brawling like, oh wait, who is that? Oh, they're fucking them up, they're fucking them up, they got the grabs, they got the grabs. Listen, you know what will get somebody together real quick is a fucking understandable grab, okay? I do it, my job. They'll be like, oh, you got all these graphs. I'm like, yes, it's easily, it's easier to consume when there's an actual visual representation as opposed to these numbers. Boop. Video footage. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yo, this is kind of really like, this is a slaughter. This is a slaughter. This is like adult level fucking like corporate combat. Yeah, they did it. They did it. They did it. Wait, Ishigami? Ishigami's the one that she's thinking of. Exactly, I fucking called it. Because why is she even thinking about Ishigami? Oh wait, but how does she know that Ishigami put this together? Why does he want to beat her so bad? Is she gonna do some like bullshit appeal to like their emotions at the last moment? You should have took Kaguya's shit. They would have made you fucking president next year. You about to embarrass yourself. Or she's about to go crazy. Oh! Okay, it's bad when the when the audience is literally like talking back to you in that kind of way. <gasps> oh! No! Miyuki, go save her. And then this will make up for you. Well, not make up, you already won. Oh! Oh, so he's been there the entire time watching her do this. But when it comes to actual, like, forward facing, so that is, she can just do back end stuff in her future. Okay, no. Oh my God. Also, I love the style to how they're presenting this right now. But, so why do you want her to lose in a landslide? He's gonna go up there. Yes. Oh my God, I love everyone now. Are you serious? Ishigami literally just, okay, well I already loved him. This is such a huge testament of character. Oh. Oh. Oh my God, okay. Oh, this is so, oh goodness. Oh my God, they're giving her such a solid origin story. Oh my God. She's gonna be part of this series. She's like, she's a main character. She's a main supporting character now. Okay, but that can also make people resent you. Oh girl, fuck you. Okay, never mind. No, cause I brought, I brought my Game Boy Color. I brought my Pokemon guidebooks. I brought everything to school because no one was gonna steal that shit from me. 
They were fucking her up. They were fucking her up. I knew it. Oh, no! You are not about... I'm not about to cry. I'm not about to cry. This is supposed to be like happiness, funny, boom da boom boom da boom I'm not... They're fucking me up. Because I feel it coming. Oh, my God. No. 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 He got a mic and everything already. Ooh. Help her. Help her. I know this is part of the process, but I'm like, oh, if you have, look at him because it'll probably be easier to tell him as opposed to telling the crowd. <gasps> oh, it's a wrap. No, you don't get him either. She's going to make it next year. When they graduate, she's going to make it. Oh, she got the grabs too. Oh, oh. Spoiled brats with good grades. Damn. Okay, now hold on. That would get my attention too because I'd be like, now bitch, I got the grades, so why the fuck you even care? No! Okay. Yeah, you're part of it. You're part of it. You're, you're just as crazy as everybody else. Okay. A moral shoot cheat. I don't think you need to be president next year. Or maybe she'll change and she'll change her like viewpoints over the next year with them. Oh my God, Miyuki's so fucking cool. He's helping her so much right now. Also, a debate style seems to work. Girl, of course you lost. But you looked good for next year though. No, they're gonna compliment you. Yay! There's always next year! Oh my god. Okay. Ishigami and Miyuki. Oh my goodness. Exactly. It's so fucking heartwarming to see the growth in real time. Oh my god. Look at you, Ishigami, having a fucking heart. Because she saw you up there bantering with homegirl. And they're gonna fucking be added. They're gonna be added! Oh my god! I knew it was coming, but now I'm super excited. Oh shit. Holy shit. You fucked. Okay. Oh. I actually really like the black with like the flakes background. I think it's cute. Oh shit. Okay. Oh my god! I love this. I love this so much. Cause she probably, she's gonna have to be able to do that next year without you. What? Oh, okay, you just want to support your friend. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. Miko, you need to do it. You need to do it. You need to do it. You better not fall in love with fucking Miyuki, bitch. Don't you do it. Okay, she's not a bitch, but like, come on. Actually, you know what? That's probably gonna happen. You two should be thanking Ishigami. You wouldn't be where you were without Ishigami. Oh, Wait, I feel like they've made... Ishigami looks like he's grown. I don't know if it's like the art, the style. But like, yeah. Oh, the smile. Okay. Because he didn't know that it fucking happened. He doesn't know. Mm! <laughs> oh, okay, so that's what that flashback was from the previous episode. She was doing dirty shit. There's no way in the hell that you're not gonna be the vice president. He literally was, okay, you asked him and he was doing it for you. Oh, gambling and prostitutes. Wait, you've been watching too many. Okay, no girl. Yeah. Oh my God, I feel like this is coming. Yeah, mental disorder, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, please tell me he's behind the curtain. I knew that fucked her up. That's why she felt that way, yeah. He did that for Ishigami, girl. He's here, he's there, he's there! Oh my God, she's a fucking ninja. She's literally a ninja. 
Oh my God. Maturity, yes. Oh, I need you. She gonna give him a one word answer. Wait, a middle finger? Oh, okay. Look at you. Look at you. Look at you! Oh. He definitely gives you special treatment. Exactly. Oh, he still has the fan. Oh. Oh, wow. Okay, they're, 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 tell, they're telling us all of the arcs. They're telling us all of the arcs. And the newbies are coming. The newbies are coming. And it grows. They get it! Oh, this is so satisfying! Oh, this is such a fucking joy. Oh my god. Oh, uh, listen, I gotta say it. This season is definitely turning me the fuck out more than the first season. Like, I'm, I'm, I have to be so fucking honest about it. Like, the whole like Miko thing is just. Uh, how do I put it? It's just. It highlighted damn near everyone's just like character. Like everyone's character. And it also brought in a brand new character and gave her one of the best, I think one of the best like foundations and like intros of a character in like an anime or IP that I think I've ever seen. Like we got all the background because we were, we're, we're a full season in already. So for her to come in like what? one third of the way into the second season and for her to be a new main character and for her them to develop her like that in that amount of time that's really fucking good that's really fucking good like kudos to the mangaka kudos to the fucking animation team kudos to the studio kudos to everybody i am so so excited to see what's gonna happen um and also i'm excited to see if they're gonna be like new characters in addition to miko because like now we have like a full fucking year until the next election cycle, which I mean, well actually no, I mean, no, we have a, like a year. Well no, yo, there's gonna be a full year and uh, they're gonna be uh, third years when the next election cycle comes, but they're gonna end up helping Miko. Like, so that could even be another thing. And so like them not being in the student council, but like just like being there. Uh, this is so this is so pleasing it's so pleasing it's so heartwarming and like there were comedic aspects but like it's like real shit because like people be dirty like that like because there i do i do know of people in real life myself personally who are just like oh well, we should just follow the rules and it's just like well girl that's not how shit works because the people who are telling you to follow the rules don't follow the rules themselves so like fuck that like first of all but then also i can see like oh well we have like a name to maintain and you know a history a legacy and things like that and Personally, like me being someone, I uh, listen, y'all. I'm from Texas. I've been around. Like, you know, there's a whole bunch of like hippie hoppy. Like, you gotta do this and hee haw hoo hoo. We don't do this shit here. It's like no, like things change. You have to change with the times. Um, but I do understand like certain um uh, places wanting to maintain a certain level of like dignity. But then at the same time, it's just like, well, girl, like the dignity that you're maintaining, like, is it worthwhile? Like. Like, you know, you think people see you this way, but they actually see you this way, but you're too fucking focused on this that you don't even actually see the way that actual people perceive you. Okay, see, this is about to go in a whole other direction. I'm gonna save this for another time. Anyways, love the episode, love the new addition to the student council, and uh, I cannot wait. I cannot wait for the, the remainder of this. And oh my God, this is kind of running long. So anyways, let's, let's end this here. If you haven't already, like and subscribe, comment down below, turn notifications, follow me on social media, subscribe to the Patreon if you want to watch fully unedited or fully uncensored versions of this. Um, and just to be sure, or just to let everyone know, support in all formats is appreciated. And it is almost, it's almost late, late. So I'm gonna end this here. I'm gonna knock out the rest of the six episodes before the premiere on Friday. And yeah, I'll see y'all then. Bye.